Hello everyone. In this video, we will look at a case study on displaying prime numbers. So we're going to write a program that displays the first 50 prime numbers in five lines, each containing 10 numbers. What is a prime number? A prime number is an integer greater than zero. And its only positive divisor is one or itself. For example, two, three, five, seven are prime numbers, but four, six, eight, nine are not. For seven, the only positive divisor is one and itself. So it is a prime number for four, two is a divisor for four. So four is not a prime number. The problem is to display the first 50 prime numbers in five lines, each of which contains 10 numbers. So what do we do? And we're gonna break this problem into the following tasks. First, determine whether a given number is prime. Then we look at the numbers from one, starting from two. So one is not a prime number from two, three, four, five, six, and test whether it is prime. Count all the prime numbers you have tested, count up to 50, and then display each prime number and display 10 numbers per line. So we can write this in the pseudocode, set the number of prime numbers to be printed as a constant. So this number of primes is 50. Use count to track the number of prime numbers. Set its initial value to zero. Set initial number to two. We're gonna start from two, then three, four, check all these numbers, whether they are prime or not, and count it and display it. So writing this while loop, why this count is less than number of primes. Test whether prime is number is a prime. If it is a prime, display it and increase the count. And also now, after this is done, regardless whether it's a prime or not, we have to increase the number by one. So this is the number we're going to check the next possible prime. And so let's look at this. How do you test whether a number is prime, test whether a number is prime. So let's write the uh, pseudo code algorithm as this. We're gonna use a Boolean variable is prime to denote whether the number is prime. Set is prime to true initially. And now go through all this possible divisor starting from two and up to this uh, number, uh, number divided by two. So check if this is a divisor for this number. If so, it is not a prime. Set is prime to false, exit the loop. And after all this is done, and you did not find a, a divisor, so that it means it is a prime number. We already set the prime to true. This is the complete program, so number of primes we set to 50. And this is the count to count the number of prime numbers. This is the number, this is gonna check if this is a prime. And so this is number of primes per line, we're gonna display 10 numbers per line. So here's the count, and this is the count, and initially is zero. So let's check this, is, is prime is true now, and writing this code for loop to, test if this number is a prime. So after this for loop is finished, is prime is if it's false, and so it's not a prime, otherwise it's prime. So if the force is coming from here, this you find a divisor. Now check is prime, 
It is true. So we're going to count to the number of primes. And now you're going to display it. So how are you going to display it? So look at the count is remain the number of primes per line is equal to zero. We're going to start a new line. Otherwise, we stay on the same line. So this is for the every 10 numbers, you're going to start a new line. So here is every 10 numbers, that's zero here. And this is a print line. So otherwise it's just not print line, it's print. And regardless whether this number is prime or not, you're going to now increase number by one to check what, whether the next number is a prime. This is the entire program. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.